Hey guys, this is Josh here from Trillium Wild Edibles, and today I want to bring you all an identification video on the Orange Daylily. This is an exceptionally common plant that you're going to be finding all across North America. There are a couple different varieties of Daylily that you're probably going to be finding. Now this excludes the hundreds of different hybrid varieties, but there are two main edible ones. One is the Orange Daylily that we're looking at here, and then the other would be the Tiger Lily. There are a couple of ways to tell these apart. One of those is the tiger lily will have spots inside of the flower petals. Versus on this one, if we look, there are no spots. Whenever we look at the flowers of the orange daylily, we're going to notice that there are six petals and they are orange like the name implies with this white stripe going through the center of each petal. Another thing we're going to notice is that as we get down towards the throat of the flower, it will terminate into a yellow center, just like we can see here. The pistils or stamens of this flower are very long and they stick straight up, just like we can see on this right here. Right over here, we can see a pod of one of the young flowers right here. Let's take a look at the leaves of this plant. If we look at the ground near the base of the plant, we're going to notice these very long grass-like blades. These are the leaves of our orange daylily. So this is an extremely easy plant to identify. If we look at the back side of the leaves, we're going to notice this very prominent midrib or vein running through the center of it. And if we look at the top of it, it might be a little hard to notice here. Let me zoom in to see if I can get this better. If we look at the top of it, it actually kind of V's in from the top. It's got a somewhat uh, of a V-like shape to these leaves. They are generally somewhat pale green in color. They're not going to be dark green like we can see on this leaf over here. You can see this very, very contrasted, almost neon lime green sort of color. And this is very common of these leaves this time of year in uh, the very end of June. All parts of this plant are edible from the leaves to the flowers to these pods, the stems, and the roots. The roots are generally the most prized portion of the plant because they generally taste the best. So I wanted to let you guys know that this plant is edible and it's extremely delicious. The roots of this plant have been prized in China for thousands and thousands of years. This plant has been eaten by people for just as long, if not longer. There are several hybrid varieties of lilies that you might find in gardens and garden centers. Keep in mind that not all of those are edible. This one and the tiger lily are definitely edible. So keep that in mind whenever you are out foraging, if you plan on going foraging for any day lilies. So that's how you guys can identify the orange day lily. I thank all of you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you learned something. If you want to learn more about wild edibles or medicinal plants, please make sure to subscribe.